If you've got kids who want to perform magic with coins, we've got a great collection of tricks for you. We've got a great collection for you. All you need are coins and some household materials. First, we'll show you the tricks and then we'll show you how to do them. Let's get started. Let's try and make a coin disappear. So first of all, we have these caps here and that's one coin, two, three, other cap goes on top. I'm gonna to turn these over three times. That's one, two, three. See how we did here. And it looks as if one coin has mysteriously vanished. See if you can follow the matchbox. Is it this one? Actually, it's this one. All right, let's try it again. Is it this one? You're right, one more time. Where's the coin now? And it's right here. We're going to start here with one, two coins. Let's try and do a little magic here. Wave the hand and I think we want some more. And yes, I think it happened. There's one, two, three, four, five coins. Here's how you perform the trick. I'm using these caps here, but it also works just fine if you want to use bowls. So you can use two bowls. Probably with the kids, it's better to use a disposable bowl. But secret is always the same because these are just ordinary caps, quarters. I'm using three American quarters, but secret is that this coin here has tape under a double stick tape. So, perform the trick. I show the first coin. I stick it to the bottom. I show that it's clearly inside of the cap. But meanwhile, I'm pressing it in with my finger. I take the other one, put it on top, put the other one on top, then place these together. And I turn it over three times. So you go one, two, three as if the magic is happening and then when you take this one off put it on the table this one actually still has the coin in it and so now you can show that one disappeared here's what you'll need for the trick you'll need an empty water bottle you'll need a coin i'm using an american quarter here and the secret is this is something a grown-up will have to do but on the side you cut this hole right here in the side 
of the bottle. So show your coin and then slam it into the coin, the coin into the bottle and you've got a miracle. Here's what you'll need to perform the trick. You'll need matchboxes. These are ordinary matchboxes and you're going to need three matchboxes and you're going to need a coin. Two coins actually. So let me show you what's going on. In the beginning you show the matchboxes to be ordinary and empty. You place the coin inside one of the boxes. You shake it and at any time whenever you want to you can make the coin travel to any box you want. So when you move it around it really doesn't matter what you do because the coin is over here. How does that work? Well actually the coin is still over here as you probably figured out. So why does this one still rattle? Well here's the secret because remember I said you needed three match boxes, two coins, there's only one coin in play here but up my sleeve here I have a third match box with a coin in it so when I shake the right hand whichever box I shake with the right hand is going to make the noise. Here's how you perform the trick. I'm using a coin, an American Quarter. I have an empty, ordinary matchbox. What you do is you jam the coin between the sleeve and the drawer. For this trick, you're gonna need some coins. I just happen to be using five American quarters. And we have here a paper plate. And the difference is, paper plate has an envelope here that I just made out of paper. You can also use a commercial envelope, cut the flap off, and tape it to the bottom of your plate. So you take the extra coins, they go into the pocket. In the beginning, you show you have one coin, two coins, and of course you have this pocket underneath with the coins. Place your hand underneath the pocket, pour the coins out, and then you can count them out and you magically have one, two, three, four, five, or however many coins you want for this trick. <laughs> 